Let us learn how to swap the values of two integer variables by just using addition and subtraction. I'll take two integer variables a is equal to 10 and b is equal to 20. Now a is equal to a plus b that is 10 plus 20 which is 30. Now b is equal to a minus b that is 30 minus 20 which is 10. Now a is equal to a minus b again. So a is 30 and b is 10 which means now a has a value of 20. That's how we swap values of two integer variables without using any temporary variable and by just simply making use of arithmetic operations plus and minus. Please go through this logic without fail. I'll output the values of a and b before and after swapping. Let me execute it. So before swapping a is 10 and b is 20, after swapping a is 20 and b is 10. Let me add new line characters here so that the output is tidy and nice. Let's look at the logic once again. a plus b is 30, a minus b that is 30 minus 20 is 10 and 30 minus 10 is 20 which will be stored in a. So a is 30 and b is 20. Let me re remove and ask the user of user to input the values of a and b. Okay, I'll use scanf method which we already discussed in one of our previous video tutorial. So I'll ask the user to input two integer variables and store it in the address of a and b. Ampersand a which means address of a, ampersand b means address of b. Let us execute it. Let me enter 5 and 3. So after swapping a is 3 and b is 5. Let us clear this further. So I'll display what user entered for values of a as well as b. So this would look nice. So I'll enter a is equal to 50 and b is equal to 10. So you enter a is equal to 50 and b is equal to 10 after swapping a is 10 and b is 50. So that's how we swap the values of integer variables just by using addition and subtraction. Thanks for watching. Please share this video with your friends on social networking sites. Visit the link present in the description section of this YouTube video for further notes and clarifications. And please do not forget to like this video on YouTube and stay subscribed to our YouTube channel and blog. Thank you.